Hey everybody, Ryan McCaffrey with IGN, joined by Mitch Dyer for, wait a sec, Mitch, this, this isn't working. No, Let's, right. no this is, this is hey. too big. <laughs> uh, I'm Ryan McCaffrey with IGN, joined by fellow Gears of War superfan Mitch Dyer. That's me. And uh, Mitch, what the hell is going on here? Uh, this is the actual biggest box in the universe, and it is home to the Gears of War 3 Hammer Burst replica. This uh, is a one-to-one -one scale deal, right? Yeah, Whole so thing. yeah, there were 500 of these made. This is a like full scale, like this is what it looks like in the Gears of War universe. How much is this gonna set me back if I'm insane? Uh, you know, not much, just $850. Okay, I'm gonna... Stun silence right there. <laughs> we're gonna pretend charities don't <laughs> exist, and we're gonna pretend that this, this is a good plan. Yeah. But let's go ahead and unbox it and see what right, $850 buys you. All right. So this is... The, the replica itself is actually 35 pounds. So we may have to work together. Oh, nice. come on! Oh, man. It begins. Okay. Right. You want me to hold the box and you... you want me to That's roll? probably the best way to go. You, you're right. Yeah, you... There we go. All right. Good. Yeah, just get that okay. box out of here. I'm now Jeez. off camera, coming back into frame. All right, all right. Oh, we're gonna need a blade. We need scissors or we, something. We need a blade <laughs> to cut the tape. All right, you pull that out. Oh, wait, we're doing this. Hold on. Okay, I got you. I got you. You got it. Teamwork. Just, this is gonna be the thirty. This is gonna be a thirty-minute long unboxing. This is video. the worst unboxing video IGN has ever done. Ugh. Okay. All right. We're on to something. You have keys. Yeah, keys. keys. All right, hold on, gotta do the whole thing. It's fine, they'll just fast forward this part. And they'll miss all of our witty banter. Pop it open. All right, all right. Hold on, I don't oh, know yeah, if we let's should. definitely put it down. <laughs> <laughs> this looks like an actual weapon case. Like, you would take this into war and- Do you have the guns? I got the cash. You would unbox this in real life, in war. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> okay, all right, hold on, before we- before we uh, reveal, do the full reveal, Mitch, I'm gonna let you do the honors. There you go. Jesus Christ. <laughs> there we go. You are officially a, a uh, member of the COGS. Uh, this is exhausting. <laughs> Holding this is exhausting. <laughs> also, come on, Ryan, this is the locust way. Get it together. Uh, so this well, is- Well, but you pick it up as, give me a break. It's legit. What I said is not incorrect. <laughs> yes. Assuming that I've spent eight hundred fifty dollars. Yeah. Well, actually, where can I? So it's what's uh, Project Triforce.com. Project, which uh, those guys have made a lot of yeah, like, they do super a lot high of, end stuff, yes, right? Absolutely. So uh, I've ordered it from there. It's one yes. of five hundred. Yeah. Let's. Talk, I mean, check out the, the craftsmanship on this. It, price aside, the, the, this yeah. is insane. Craftsmanship I mean, the, the, the on detail here. is awesome. It's got a, like an incredible attention to detail. If you're a Gears fan, you know, like, oh, here's the you know the Locust logo here. This cross. Yep. Uh, it's got like the red paint on it, so it looks. Like you know, exactly leather wrap like, straps. Yeah, leather wrap straps here, and then like on the on the uh, I don't know my gun terminology. Hilt, the stock, right? the, the stock. Hilt. Oh yeah. Uh, it has like a belt, so you can like your stock is tied to the rest of the weapon. Uh, it's really heavy because it's really uh, high quality metal. Yeah, you know this is not a <laughs> cheap little thing uh, in the body. Like it, the form of it is just really really nice. Uh, and you know it's painted and it's like a little scuffed up as though it's like, you know. I, I, like I will say, where I, you just find it and you're like, oh, I guess I'll use the hammer. I kind of wish for 850, and just in general, I just, I kind of wish it came with a stand. This, this was it in the box. Maybe we can balance it. I'm not gonna roll it. <laughs> that's that not one. a good plan. No. Don't try that. Yeah, and it's also got LEDs on the side. If you charge it up, we yeah, have we didn't. Time. We, took no, it, we literally just, took it out of the box. Yeah, so if you charge it up, like this area here lights up. Uh, it's not like a toy where you pull a trigger and it lights up. Like, it's just, <laughs> it's just on. There's no actual trigger you pull. And then remember, I mean, so if you've forgotten in the game, this yes. is the like pull the trigger as fast as you can, sort of single shot, but not really single yeah, shot. Yeah, in Gears One it was the triple shot. The hammer burst was like a three shot submachine gun. Here yeah. in Gears Three, this this version of it is the yeah, like you say, feather the trigger as fast yeah. as you can. Pretty good. Well, uh, yeah, find a good sturdy spot on your wall. Make yeah. sure it's a strong wall that can support yeah. a 35, 35 pound pounds. object. And uh, yeah, for all the craziest video game accessories you could possibly have in your life, you're already in the right place here at IGN.